I am in southern France at the site where the world is making the fusion reactor at ITER. And this building you see, some say, is mini India in southern France. These structures which you see behind me are what are called parts of the cryostat. Cryostat is that very large vessel through which all components which are part of the ITER reactor would go through. You can see it has been made by ITER India and this cryostat or this large world's largest thermos flask which sometimes people also say is a refrigerator has been made by India. So India having made the world's largest thermos flask or a refrigerator most of the components made in India transported all the way and sent all the way to southern France at Eater. Behind me is uh, one of the another big structure which is part of the cryostat. The entire structure finally is gonna weigh 3850 tons which is a massive amount of weight. This will be the single heaviest or largest component of the Eater reactor. And what does Eater reactor do? Eater reactor is trying to harness fusion energy. Fusion energy is where two atoms fuse and then energy is released. It is considered one of the cleanest forms of energy and India is contributing in a very big way. This cryostat is a very important component of the Eater reactor, without which Obviously, the ITER reactor would not be able to function. India is contributing several other parts, but this is one very important component being made by Larsen and Tubro and then transported all the way from India to southern France, assembled here, and then finally will be installed in the ITER reactor. If all goes well, by 2025, the ITER reactor should become functional and the heat should be generated. It's still a long way away. But India and ITER go hand in hand. This is a marriage which literally one can say has been made in heaven. India and ITER trying to take it forward to harness fusion energy, which is to create the sun on earth. So India helping create the sun, not in India, but in southern France. At Kadash in southern France, Palav Bagla.